Hey, welcome back air gunners. And like most of you, I'm getting ready for the upcoming air gunning season, which is going to include a little bit of field target, a little bench rest, some plinking. And I really am trying to just help fine tune my equipment to get that competitive edge on the competitors. And I found a product here that I picked up and I think will not only help me, but help you as well. It's from a small, but very innovative company by the name of Crawford and Lip. And you've probably seen a lot of their products on the FX Impact. Now, the FX Impact is not the only gun that they make products for. So a little backstory on this. Last October, I was at Extreme Bench Rest 2019, and I ran into Steven, who is one of the up and coming air gun accessory designers in the industry. And after talking for a bit, he mentioned he had an accessory that may just help take my day state rifle to another level. And that was the KLSC. And not only does it fit day state rifles, but it fits a lot of rifles that have the Minelli stock. So it fits my day state Wolverine R, it fits my day state Red Wolf, it fits my Diana Skyhawk, and it would even fit an FX Crown to name a few of the rifles that it fits. Now, if you're wondering, will this accessory fit my air gun? Well, it's very easy to tell. I'm gonna take a picture and put it right here. You're gonna see that. And that picture shows us the type of shoulder stock that this will fit. So if your shoulder stock looks like the one here, then it is very likely that this product, the Crawford & Lip KLSC, will also fit your air gun. So this shoulder pad is extremely adjustable first and foremost. You can really get it snug in, hug your shoulder, and it has a modular design. So right here you see it with a monopod feature that we're gonna talk about here in a minute. But this monopod feature can be removed and the spacer that is in it taken out also. So regardless though, the shoulder piece here, uh, often referred to as a butt hook, is re extremely helpful and beneficial to field target shooters, is beneficial to bench rest shooters, and just those of you looking for a little bit more consistency, because what it does is it really hugs your shoulder and it allows you to then keep your head and everything lined up because it hits your shoulder the same place every time. You can see how much more solid it is pushing up and down. It really locks in there. So beyond that though, I mentioned earlier, it has a spacer. Well, that spacer is here and that spacer is for this monopod feature. The monopod feature helps you to adjust the scope and get your uh, reticles right on the target and where you need to be aiming. Uh, I'm in a very solid position. So first and foremost, there's a thumb screw. You can adjust it and you make your big adjustments right here. You can see how much movement that has. And once you get it locked in, it also has a micro adjuster in it. So if I'm sitting here shooting, I can then take this and just twist it. And I don't know if you can see, but that rifle is starting to move. And that is a little threaded screw right here. Now, not only is this monopod uh, adjustable that direction, but I can also have it switch sides. So if I wanted the monopod feature to be on the, uh, for me, the inside of the stock is just two screws and swap it over and put it on the other side of the stock. So it's very ambidextrous and has a lot of options built in. This product is well built. It's built out of anodized aluminum and you can either comes in black or silver. So if you want it to blend in, I went with the black, or if you want to go ahead and have it pop and really stand out, you can go with the silver normal aluminum look. Now, a couple of days ago, you probably saw me using this exact rifle for the King Me Challenge. And using a Day State Wolverine R, I was able to shoot 25 caliber pellets stacked off at 25 yards. And I hit two out of three. I was super impressed, super happy with that result. And I do attribute some of that, obviously, a lot of it to the rifle, but then also being able to practice and get my head position the same way. And this shoulder piece really helped me to be consistent in everything I was doing. Guys, if you'd like to take a look at Crawford and & Lip and see what other products they have, 
or maybe you're looking to pick up the KLSC for your air gun, I'm gonna go ahead and put a link below. It is not an affiliate link. I don't get anything from your purchases, but I do want you to be able to find it easily and have access to it. So as always, guys, until next time, may your trigger pull stay smooth, may your pellets fly straight, and we'll see you right here for another edition of the Air Gun Advisory.